Welcome to Easy Driver, the most reliable source of automotive information on YouTube. Replacing your car's evaporative emission control canister, a simple DIY fix. Ever noticed a decrease in your vehicle's fuel efficiency or a peculiar smell near the fuel tank? It might be time to check your evaporative emission control canister. This canister plays a crucial role in capturing fuel vapors before they escape into the atmosphere, helping to reduce harmful emissions. Typically, it lasts about the lifetime of your vehicle, but can need replacement due to damage or clogs. Key signs that you're due for a replacement include trouble starting your engine, a drop in mileage, or failing an emissions test. Understanding when and why to replace your canister can save you from future headaches and keep your car running cleanly and efficiently. Understanding Evaporative Emission Control Canister Evaporative emission control canisters play a crucial role in reducing harmful emissions released by vehicles. By capturing and storing fuel vapors that would otherwise escape into the atmosphere, these canisters contribute to a cleaner environment and improved air quality. Let's delve into the components of the canister and its impact on vehicle performance. Components of the canister the evaporative emission control canister consists of several key components that work together to effectively trap fuel vapors. One essential part is the charcoal-filled chamber, which acts as a sponge to absorb and retain the fuel vapors. As vapors enter the canister, they are absorbed by the charcoal, preventing them from being released into the air. Another critical component is the purge valve, which controls the flow of vapors into the engine. When the engine is running, the purge valve opens to allow the stored vapors to be burned off as part of the combustion process. This helps prevent the buildup of harmful emissions in the vehicle. Impact on vehicle performance. A faulty evaporative emission control canister can have detrimental effects on a vehicle's performance. When the canister malfunctions, it may lead to decreased fuel efficiency as the fuel vapors escape instead of being properly stored. This not only contributes to air pollution but also results in wasted fuel and increased expenses for the vehicle owner. Moreover, a damaged canister can cause potential engine issues such as rough idling, stalling or difficulty starting the vehicle. These problems not only compromise the performance of the vehicle but can also lead to costly repairs if left unchecked. Therefore, Maintaining a properly functioning evaporative emission control canister is essential for both environmental protection and optimal vehicle operation. Signs of a failing canister Have you noticed your vehicle exhibiting odd behaviors like the check engine light persistently glowing, a pungent smell of fuel lingering around, or failing emissions tests that leave you scratching your head? These could be indications pointing towards a malfunctioning evaporative emission control canister, which is a key component responsible for controlling harmful fuel vapors from escaping into the atmosphere. Let's look at the signs that suggest it might be time to consider a replacement. Diagnostic Procedures When faced with potential issues related to your vehicle's evaporative emission control canister, diagnostic procedures become vital to pinpoint and confirm the fault. Mechanics often employ advanced tools like OBD2 scanners to read the system codes, providing crucial insights into the underlying problem. Furthermore, smoke machines are utilized to detect any leaks in the system by injecting smoke and observing where it escapes, aiding in the precise identification of the canister's failure. Importance of timely replacement Delaying the replacement of a faulty evaporative emission control canister can have far-reaching consequences beyond just a minor inconvenience. Not only does it jeopardize your vehicle's performance and fuel efficiency, but it also poses significant environmental risks. A malfunctioning canister can lead to the release of harmful emissions into the air, contributing to pollution levels. Moreover, ignoring the issue can result in potential long-term damage to other essential components of your vehicle's emission control system, leading to costly repairs down the road. When faced with the telltale signs of a failing canister, swift action is key to ensuring both your vehicle's well-being and environmental responsibility. By addressing the issue promptly, you not only safeguard your car's performance but also play a part in reducing your carbon footprint and preserving the air quality around you. Replacing the canister Before jumping into replacing the evaporative emission control canister, it's crucial to prioritize safety. 
Start by disconnecting the battery to prevent any electrical mishaps. Additionally, depressurizing the fuel system is vital to avoid any fuel leaks or dangerous situations. Ensuring these safety measures are in place will set the stage for a smooth replacement process. Preparation and safety measures. Disconnect the battery. Begin by locating the battery in your vehicle and safely disconnecting it. This step is essential to prevent any electrical accidents during the replacement process. Depressurize the fuel system. Next, relieve the pressure in the fuel system to prevent any fuel spillage or accidents. Follow the manufacturer's guidelines to depressurize the fuel system effectively. Installation steps. Removing the old canister. Start by locating the existing evaporative emission control canister in your vehicle. Carefully disconnect any hoses or connections attached to the canister, keeping track of their placements for reassembly. Installing the new canister. Once the old canister is removed, it's time to install the new one. Follow the manufacturer's instructions for the specific torque specifications required for securing the canister in place. Jose Connections. Make sure to reconnect all hoses to the new canister securely. Check for any signs of wear or damage on the hoses and replace them if necessary to ensure proper functioning. Reassembly Steps. As you put everything back together, double-check all connections and components to ensure they are properly secured. Test the new canister to verify that it is functioning correctly before completing the reassembly process. By following these safety measures and installation steps diligently, you can successfully replace the evaporative emission control canister in your vehicle without any complications. Remember to refer to your vehicle's manual for specific instructions tailored to your make and model. Post-replacement checks. After replacing the evaporative emission control canister, it's crucial to perform thorough post-replacement checks to ensure optimal functionality of the new canister. From test driving the vehicle to conducting a final inspection, these checks are essential steps to guarantee that the emission system is operating efficiently. Test drive validation. Take the vehicle for a test drive to verify that the evaporative emission control canister is working as intended. During the test drive, pay attention to any unusual sounds, smells or engine performance issues. Monitor the vehicle's fuel efficiency and emission levels to ensure there are no abnormalities post-replacement. System Functionality Assessment Perform a system functionality assessment by inspecting the connections, hoses and seals of the new canister. Check for any signs of leaks, damage or loose fittings that could impact the effectiveness of the emissions control system. Ensure that all components are securely in place and properly connected. Emission System Scan Utilize diagnostic tools to conduct an emission system scan and check for any error codes or malfunctions related to the evaporative emission control system. Address any detected issues promptly to prevent further damage or deterioration of the emissions control components. Final Inspection Conclude the post-replacement checks with a final inspection of the entire emission system. Verify that all components, including the canister, purge valve and vent valve, are in good condition and functioning correctly. Double-check the installation of the new canister to confirm that it meets the manufacturer's specifications. In summary, conducting thorough post-replacement checks is vital to ensuring the proper operation of the evaporative emission control canister. By test driving the vehicle, assessing system functionality, scanning for errors, and performing a final inspection, you can maintain the efficiency and integrity of the emissions control system. Stay proactive in monitoring and maintaining your vehicle's emissions components for optimal performance and environmental sustainability. Maintaining your vehicle's evaporative emission control canister is crucial for both performance and environmental well-being. By replacing a worn-out canister promptly, you ensure efficient fuel usage and reduce harmful emissions. Prioritizing this simple maintenance task not only benefits your vehicle, but also contributes to a cleaner, healthier planet. Stay proactive in caring for your evaporative emission control system to drive smoothly while being environmentally responsible. Your car and the earth will thank you. Please comment, like, share and subscribe for more automotive information like this. Thank you for watching.